In this problem, we are working with histograms for numerical data. Here are the scores for 19 students on a math test. Draw the histogram for these data. We can see that the graph given has five intervals of equal size. There's 7 to seven, 70 to 74, which is here, 75 to 79, which is here, 80 to 84, 85 to 89, and 90 to 94. There are five values that fall in the interval between 70 and 74. We have 72, 74, 71, 73, and 70. So in the category of 70 to 74, there are five numbers. So we make a bar up to five. That is the frequency of which they occur. There are three values in the interval between 75 and 79. We have 79, 78, and 76. So in the 75 to 79 category, we go up to three, and that's where we make our bar. That is the frequency of which they occur. And we can do the same thing for the rest of the numbers. So if we look at the category 80 to 84, there are 1, 2, 3, 4, 4 numbers. So we can go up to 4, and that's where we'll make our bar. And go back and cross those numbers out. Look to the next category, 85 to 89. So we have 1, 2, 3, 4, another 4 numbers. So it goes the same. We draw our bar. There's also 4 numbers in that category. Then we can go back and cross those out. And do the last category, 90 to 94. So there's one, two, three. So we can make our bar up to three for our last column. And then we've used up all of the numbers. So our final graph will look like this. With the categories here, we can see how many numbers are in each category. So our histogram, histogram shows the frequency of which numbers occur in which category.